Hi everyone, in today's video we will see how to activate your Boost Mobile eSIM. Boost Mobile eSIM activation. First, step 1. Sign up for the service. Visit the Boost Mobile website or a Boost Mobile retailer to sign up for the new plan. Click on the activate button. Click on phone type brought from the Boost Mobile or brought from the retail partner. Click on continue. Step 2. Start activation. Select start activation button under the new customer. If you are an existing customer, click on Existing Customer. Step 3. Choose the eSIM. Click on Activate Now with the eSIM link. Step 4. Enter the required details. During the sign up, enter the IMEA number of your eSIM compatible phone. You can find the IMEA number by dialing star hash 06 hash or going to the Android settings then about and iOS settings then general then about. Open the push notification to install the eSIM and click continue. For iOS 14 plus, enter the IMEI 1 or IMEI 2. For iPhone 13 and earlier, enter the IMEI 2. New number activation take minutes. Number transfer up to 24 hours. Remove any physical SIM or delete all eSIM you wouldn't be using. Ensure no other Apple device are connected to your Wi-Fi. Step 5. Scan the QR code and activate SIM. Get the eSIM QR code, complete the sign up process and you will receive an eSIM QR code. Install the eSIM profile on your phone, scan the QR code or follow the on-screen instructions to install the eSIM profile. Activate the eSIM. The eSIM will activate within the 30 minutes for a new number or up to 24 hours for a new number transfer. How to scan QR code on iOS Math. Third one, scanning the QR code. Open the mail, take a screenshot of your QR code. Go to the settings and cellular, then add SIM. Use the QR code and open the photo and upload a screenshot from your mobile. You choose a label for your eSIM. Select your eSIM for cellular data only under the default line page. Your new eSIM should appear in the, your cellular data or mobile data plans. Select your newly activated eSIM plan to enable the data roaming on your eSIM. Total the turn on this line switch. Return to the settings, then cellular or mobile data and then cellular data. Choose between the cellular data and mobile data for your eSIM. Turn off and allow the cellular data switching to avoid the charges on your other line. Navigate to your eSIM settings and select the boost mobile network. Method 2. Entering the details manually. Here are the steps to activate your eSIM on your device. Save the SMDP plus address and activation code details from your order confirmation. Go to the settings then cellular then cellular data select. Add the eSIM or add cellular plan and choose the enter details manually. Enter the SMDP plus address and activation code and save in step 1. Choose a label for your eSIM. Select your eSIM for cellular data only under the default line page. Your new eSIM should appear in your cellular data list. Select your newly activated eSIM plan to enable the data roaming on your eSIM and total the turn on this line switch. Return to your settings, then cellular or setting, then mobile data. Choose between the cellular data or mobile data for your eSIM. Turn off allow cellular data switching to avoid charges on your other line. Navigate to your eSIM settings and select the supported network. How to scan QR code on Android? Method 1. Scanning QR code. On your phone, go to the settings menu, then network and internet, then tap on add button. Enter the ask download a SIM instead and press add a number using eSIM. To download your SIM, press next and tap Use a different network. Tap on the download on the bottom right. Scan your QR code and return to the settings menu. Then network and internet and then SIM. Turn on the eSIM. Activate the mobile data and data roaming. Note, please turn off your primary line to avoid roaming charges. Method 2. Enter manually. Go to the settings menu. Click on network and internet. Tap on the add button. When asked, download a SIM instead. Press add a number using eSIM. On download your SIM, press next. Tap on the use a different network. On the scan QR code from the network screen, look for the need help on the bottom right and tap it. On help adding the network screen, 
look for enter it manually and press it insert the smdp address and activation code receive in order details or sims choose the boost turn on your eSIM select boost activate the mobile data and data roaming note that please turn off your primary line to avoid roaming charges from your carrier when traveling abroad thank you for watching like this video and subscribe to our channel